in space, known as a black hole, is one where light cannot escape due to the strength of gravity there. Because matter has been compressed into a small area, there is a tremendous gravitational pull. At the conclusion of a star's life, this compression may occur. Some fading stars have formed black holes. Black holes cannot let any light through, hence they are invisible. Black holes can be found, nevertheless, using space telescopes equipped with specialized equipment. They are able to watch the activity of objects and stars that are quite near black holes. So in this video, we are going to discuss the top 5 facts about black holes in our galaxy. Welcome to our channel. If you're new here, be sure to subscribe and click the bell icon to never miss any updates. So, let's get started. Number 1. How big are black holes? Although there are three major types of black holes, they can come in a variety of sizes. The kind of black hole is determined by its mass and size. Primordial black holes are the term for the smallest ones. This particular sort of black hole is thought to be as small as an atom, but has the mass of a big mountain. Stellar black holes are the most prevalent kind of medium-sized black holes. An object with a stellar black hole's mass can have a diameter of around 10 miles and a mass that is up to 20 times that of the Sun. The Milky Way galaxy may contain dozens of star-mass black holes. Supermassive refers to the biggest black holes. These black holes have a combined mass larger than 1 million suns and could all be contained inside a ball of the solar system size circumference. According to scientific evidence, Every huge galaxy has a supermassive black hole at its heart. Sagittarius A refers to the supermassive black hole at the center of our galaxy, the Milky Way. Its mass, which is comparable to 4 million suns, would fit inside a ball with a diameter about equal to that of the sun. Number 2. How do black holes form? Early in the universe, right after the Big Bang, it is considered that primordial black holes were first created. A big star's core collapsing in on itself creates a stellar black hole. A supernova, or exploding star, is also brought on by this collapse, which sends a piece of the star into space. Supermassive black holes are thought to have developed along with the galaxy in which they are found. The galaxy's size and mass affect the supermassive black hole's size. Number 3. How many types of black holes are there? Stellar, intermediate, supermassive, and minuscule black holes are the four main categories. Stellar death is the process that produces black holes the most frequently. The majority of dying stars will expand, lose mass, and then cool to produce white dwarfs. The largest of these hot objects, those at least 10 to 20 times as massive as our Sun, will eventually collapse into either stellar mass black holes or extremely dense neutron stars. Number 4. Could a black hole destroy Earth? The universe is not filled with black holes that eat planets at random. Like other spacecraft, they adhere to the laws of gravity. To have an impact on Earth, a black hole's orbit would need to be very close to the solar system, which is unlikely. Earth would not be swallowed up if a black hole with the same mass as the Sun were to take its place. If a black hole had the same mass as the Sun, it would continue to have the same gravitational pull. As they do today, the planets would continue to circle the black hole. Number 5. How is NASA studying black holes? With the help of satellites like the SWIFT satellite, the Fermi Gamma Ray Space Telescope, and the Chandra X-ray Observatory, NASA is learning more about black holes. Fermi, which was launched in 2008, is looking for supermassive black holes and other celestial phenomena by studying gamma rays, the most intense kind of light. These kinds of spacecraft support research into the universe's creation, development, and future. That's all for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let us know in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more informative and amazing videos. Thank you for watching.